Air pollution is a serious threat in America today. Everyone deserves to have healthy air, whether you're at home, at school, at doors, or at work. Air pollution can cause influenza, asthma, lung cancer, and can contribute to many other diseases. Right now, we're going to focus on lung cancer. In 2012, about 160,000 people, or 28% of all cancer deaths, were of lung cancer. One of the biggest contributors is smoking. Smoking contributes to 80% of lung cancer deaths in women and 90% in men. Men who smoke are 23 times more likely to get lung cancer than a non-smoker, and it's 13 times more likely for a woman. However, just because you don't smoke doesn't necessarily mean you won't get lung cancer. Non-smokers have a 20 to 30 percent chance, greater chance of developing lung cancer if they are continuously exposed to secondhand smoking. How many non-smokers die of lung cancer due to secondhand smoke each year? Like 5,000? Yeah, I'd say in the hundreds of thousands. Um, I have no idea. Um, a lot. What kills more people? Smoking, AIDS, heroin, alcohol, car accidents, fires, homicide, suicide, or cocaine? Smoking. Car accidents. Smoking. That would be smoking related. Wow. Damn. Wow. What is the estimated amount of deaths due to cigarette smoking in California? Like 6,000? 2,000. 1,000. 5,000. 1,500. Oh my god. Oh man, that was a little off on that one. That's a lot. Wow. Shocking. Oh wow. Of all lung cancer deaths, how much is smoking responsible for? Like 50. 68%. 70%? Oh wow. What do you think we could do to prevent pollution? Public transfer, dependency on cars overall. I mean, we keep talking about all of these hundreds of millions of dollars we're going to be spending on 101 North over the next few years, but there's no talk about adding a light rail or a, a bullet train or anything. It's just make more lanes for more cars. Um, use electric powered cars and use less plastic bags. Uh, drive more electric cars, not have as many fireplaces, reduce uh, emissions mainly. We can encourage people to use electric cars by making them cheaper and more user friendly and for different types of drivers. What can we do to keep our lungs healthy? Uh, Beer ground smokers because of secondhand smoke. Pollution and clean air, number one. That's probably one way. Um, exercise is probably another. And, uh, you know, staying away from smoking. Not hang around smokers. Uh, reduce pollution in the cities, which would mean less cars and so uh, more use of public transport. So perhaps more BART stations uh, in different places. Just better public transport all around. As you heard from many of the people we interviewed, cars are a big reason for our air pollution. Across the US, 86% of Americans drive a car to work, and 76% of those people drive alone. That's pretty insane. Let's save the air and carpool, or like some of the people we interviewed suggested, buy an electric car. However, some better alternatives are biking, walking, or using public transportation. Let's use what the city gives us, which are Muni, BART, Samtran, Caltrain, and a lot of hills for walking.